full full, not too full. Not a red full, not a blue full. Like, so, not a me full, not a you full. <laughs> like, full, like, that shit crazy. It's my shit. <laughs> and welcome back to my channel and if you're new hi i'm sin and welcome to my channel and in today's video you guys we're going to be doing a maintenance vlog as you can see lashes need to be done eyebrows need to be done um we're not going to worry about hair right now because i have braids and i'll be at work most of the time anyway so you know it really don't matter but anyway yeah um and i'm i'm here now to get a wax get a wax i want to get my toes done we're gonna see how that go but i was going to record while driving but yeah i drove behind a police car the entire way basically here so i did not do that <laughs> i was not about to get in trouble at all but yeah so i'm here at the wax place about to get a wax i'll try to record as much as i can in here if at the most i can just record my face while i'm getting wet so i'll do that but whatever but yeah i'm about to get out of the car because i'm trying to make this quick because y'all i left work early just so that i can do this like yeah, I was not playing, okay? I need to get this done while I can. Plus, at work, they really peed me off yesterday, y'all. Trying to coach me like I don't be knowing what I got going on. Like, be for real. It looked like they got a nail salon in the plaza. I might get my nails done while I'm out here. Yeah, this light is horrible. But, yeah, y'all, I'm here. I'll show you guys where I get waxed at. I like it. Um, Literally, their Brazilian wax is $45. Usually I get my underarms done as well, and that'd be like fifty-five, sixty dollars, I think. But yeah, so I'm gonna let you guys see where I'm at. If I can get some footage of me getting my, you know, doing my wax, of course I'll show you guys that. Yeah. So let me go ahead and get a wax. Yeah, that way see different. That way see different. But I like her. I got her card. Cause I'm probably gonna book her from now on. Cause she get you in, she get you out. She do do big strips, and y'all, she was in there ripping those strips off of my Gucci. But yeah, I like her. I got a few clips, but not like actually getting my wax done. But like when she was ripping the strips off. That's all I really did. Y'all know I'd be shame. But, yeah, so. I'm about to head home. That's all the self-care I'm doing today. Because I don't feel like getting my toes done. I probably won't get my toes done. Probably going to do my own eyebrows. I do get my lashes done tomorrow, though. So, yeah. We'll see what else goes on. But we're just doing maintenance. So, I'll come back when I do something else. Mm -hmm. You know y'all get a better like close up or whatever but y'all excuse my eyes they always water after every like lash appointment like when any lash thing i had they water but yeah you guys make sure you check out my lash tag her name is on on instagram as angie lashed out i mentioned sure her ig and stuff in the video or whatever but um yeah i was gonna record in there but y'all would be talking so good having this good little conversation i don't be wanting to like that's no, just not our vibe. So one day maybe, but like it's just not our vibe. But yeah, I really wanted to hop on the camera because I wanted to rent with y'all. Y'all know I usually get in the car and I be renting. Like when I was doing my um my vlog, this vlogs, y'all, we stay in the car. But anyway, this is the rent. So let me let me give y'all a story time of what happened to me this morning. Like it really blew me because it was weird as hell. So I had met this dude at walmart right and honestly i didn't mean to attract him I didn't mean to pay him no attention but i'm the type of person if i'm walking and somebody's looking at me i'm going to look at you until you stop looking at me because i'm trying to figure out why are you looking at me like what do you want from me so that's what kind of happened 
I looked down the aisle and I seen him and he seen me. So we just were looking at each other. And I, I, I just smiled. So we walked and I walked past her. I told my sister, I was just like, oh Lord, I didn't mean to look at this boy like that. Now I don't look down because I know like I attract people with my eyes. That's just people was like that's one thing people always compliment. They be like they like my eyes, my eyes are pretty, whatever, whatever. So when we had went back, of course, because I know that he's down that aisle. I look, he's looking at me, smiling again. I'm like a little bit, I know he's gonna try to talk to me. So when we done the aisle, he coming, he try, he's he comes to shoot his shot. So as he shooting his shot, this was funny to me. So my, like I said, my sister was with me. And for those of you who know my sister, you will know that my sister is she likes girls and she is like she's not a stud but like she she gives off masculine energy that's like just her so yeah i'm with her so he comes he's shooting his shot he's talking whatever then he looks at my sister and he like hold is this your girl that's your girlfriend whatever and my sister like hey no this is my sister but even if it was, you done, you done said what you had to say at this point. So he gets my Snapchat. And if you know me, then you know the point that I'm getting to is that I do, you know, stuff on the internet. If you, don't, if you don't know, I don't know how you don't know you on my YouTube channel. But yeah, I do stuff on the internet. So like, I was snap he wanted to get Snapchats. So when he got my Snapchat, I didn't have anything up there about that lifestyle. I just had my regular content, you know, my regular stuff, because it was around my big birthday. So, I ain't say nothing to him, because I don't know him. What am I telling him my business for? And we might only speak for two days. So, I didn't tell him about what I, you know, I do as well. Y'all, excuse my eye. I just got to get back used to this. But, yeah, so, I ain't say nothing to him. So, we're having, like, light conversation and stuff like that. And then, out of the blue, he gave me his number, and he, like, what social medias do you have um call me and i'm like what so i text him i'm like it's um this talisa he like um is this no he like who this is i'm like it's talisa he like seeing with a question mark and i'm like talisa is my real name like i i, I get where you, you, you which actually didn't even click to me when he said seeing but i'm like no talisa that's my real name so he's like, um, what all social media do you have? I'm like, I have Instagram. I'm like, that's, yeah. But may I ask why you keep asking me that? So he like, oh, because I came across your Twitter. So, you know, I seen everything. And I'm just like, oh, here we go. All right. Well, what is we about to talk about? Because obviously you know now, so there's nothing to really speak about. So he's like, why wouldn't you tell me? crazy da, da, da. and I'm like why would I I don't know you to tell you my business like lucky I told you my name but he has the nerve to long story short tell me I don't see me being your boyfriend or nothing like that like you know us being nothing serious which is fine with me you know like I told him like you don't gotta explain yourself to me because I'm, I'm me it is what it is I'm talking about you don't want to be my boyfriend I don't know you like, I don't know you we have never even hung out for real and we the only time I've seen you was the one time I seen you in Walmart so that does not phase me, but it lets me know there's no point of us communicating going forward because I'm on a different path in my life right now. Yes, I'm not. That doesn't phase me. Like, I'm in the point of my life where if you're not for me, I don't want to be with you. Like, after he done told me all that, and I'm starting to like speak thanks to him because he like his homeboy showed him, you know, my Twitter because he was like showing me all. And like, y'all, y'all won't believe what I found at Walmart, blah, blah, blah. Look at this girl. And. They like, hold on, bro. Like, he say, she shot out. I'm like, I'm shot out. Fuck. And so they show him my Twitter. So I guess, I guess they knew me, which is crazy. Because, like, you see my picture and you know me that good enough. So I told him, I said, your homeboy's probably be in my DMs, to be honest. But, yeah, so they like, oh, she shot out. Look at this. She was at the third, blah, blah, blah. So he like, oh, she she up and off. She up and off. Like, she on all these dudes and stuff like that. I'm just like, see, that's why you shouldn't listen to your homeboy obviously they don't know what they're talking about and you don't know either because just because i do what i do does not mean i do it with everybody like that's not how that works some people do that and that's their business like that's good for them but me personally i'm not gonna sit here and like oh you know that's what i do too i don't do that but 
And really, and I told him, like, you blew me with that because you could have asked and try to have, like, a conversation and figure it out. And I would have told you. Look back on my Twitter page and look at the dates of these videos that you're seeing. Like, this is old content. This is old. I'm not doing all this stuff now because I don't want to be just, you know, laying around. Like, that's not in me. I want to be with my man. And if we do that, we do that. And if we don't, we don't. That's what I'm on. But your mindset is letting me know you're childish in my opinion. That's not what I'm looking for. Oh, yeah, I hate when I ride on roads like this. Cause I know it's gonna mess up my own my audio. But that's what I don't I don't like men with that mindset because what do you mean? Is but he was just like I respect you though. There's no disrespect or nothing. He was like, I still take you on a date. There's no point in us going on a date. What are we going on a date for? Lost your mind. You done sat and told me and you act like you you won't stand on it. So if you not gonna if you don't see yourself being with me, don't see yourself taking me on no date. Don't see yourself want to communicate with me do all the other stuff like we cool like i won't delete you off social media or nothing but like there's nothing for us to to talk about and i'm good you said what you said and you meant that i appreciate that you don't disrespect me for oh shit y'all i literally just got a ticket just got a ticket for driving like this like what the fuck is wrong with me yeah i gotta stop but anyway so yeah so he was just like no oh do you think that you'll make content with me like no you just said you'll never be with me which means you will never be with me no i'm not gonna we're not you know you're gonna take me on a date and i'm gonna still get some cookies no like boy but i'm not applauding the dumb shit that you just said no i don't reward no dog no no fuck i'm not rewarding no bad behavior no thank you and it was crazy because i really was gonna give dude a chance but really didn't fuck with him like he was cool and all but once he got on my phone with that bullshit, like, I, and it's crazy because I'm, I'm told him, like, I'm really, like, cool off of it, but what really got me, like, don't know dudes do this, like, they don't be in my DMs talking like this, or, like, in my messages, like, but we're gonna phone, like, they don't be on my line talking like this because, what do you mean, like, the fuck, and you still, like, it just got me because he really was on my phone talking, like, I noticed that no traffic, what the fuck. Traffic. I wonder why they going around. Okay, I'm confused as fuck. What happened? Ooh, fuck. Yeah, look at this little fucking accident. Yeah, look at that. That is crazy as hell. And they better let me. Dang, bro. They hit the fuck out of me. That's crazy. That's wow. Oh my gosh. Yeah, you got to be safe out here. Woo! That's scary. And they had the baby in the car. Mm. But yeah, y'all do really try me. Like that's the first time I do really was on my line like that. Like oh, um, but I can never be your boyfriend. Shot like that's fine. Damn. Do you not know how many niggas is in my DMs wondering why I won't be their girlfriend? And you talking about you'll be my boyfriend, like more power to you. But like, I told him I'm like you I'm in mean, my head like he must expect me to like try to fight for him. No, it ain't even like that. Like, no, that's your opinion and you gonna feel how you feel. I can't change how you feel. So you you say what you say and it is what it is, but I just couldn't believe that. Bro, what? Cause if you if he was like his main one of his biggest points was that I didn't tell him myself. But I'm like, we never even hung out for me to be like, oh, and by the way, I'ma let you know. You know, just so that you can make your decision, like, here it is. He just kept saying stuff like, I'm just so glad I didn't get my feelings involved because I would have been hurt, blah, blah, blah. And I'm like, sir, get off my phone. Like, I don't give a fuck. You don't say what you said. I said what I said. We on to the next. Like, yes. But I just, y'all, that was some. That was wild. 
but to conclude my rant, well, my story time about that, if any man, if, if y'all think that y'all don't get in my DMs and try to make me feel some way for what I do, and don't you take, you don't take care of me, or you don't put no money on no, not one bill like that, I don't give a fuck. Not one foot, not two foot, not a red foot, not a blue foot, like, so, not a me foot, not a you foot, <laughs> like, fuck, like, that shit crazy, but yeah, like, no, I don't care, because at the end of the day, you leaving is not gonna change shit, I take care of this shit, it's my shit, <laughs> but yeah, no, I just wanna have a rant with y'all, I hope that the audio be good, so that y'all can hear it, but, yeah, so I'm on the way home. I got to get low in. But my grandma didn't say they're going to take him with them, do whatever they're doing. But, yeah, so.